And I'm going to go through with you this article. This is the centerpiece on Bitcoin pricing already. It's called Bitcoin's Dance with Wall Street, Micro Strategies, Commitment, ETF Prospects, and more. I combine all the things that's happening until today to make a pitch for Bitcoin. So step one, as you know right now, MicroStrategy is a positive. Their actual cost price of Bitcoin is 29,0688. If I read uh, 29,0688. Right now trading at 31,000, they have already turned positive. Alright. So we gotta go through a few thinking behind this article. So I'm gonna guide you through. Don't panic. This one I just published like 29th of uh, June. So here we go. 668. Step one. Micro strategy or Michael Saylor has established a price floor of 29,668 per Bitcoin. And no one is as crazy as him to put in $347 million this month. Okay? Just bought only. And this was bought when he was trading at about 28,000 per Bitcoin. And as such, his total holdings is 152333 Bitcoins, purchased for approximately 4.52 billion. Average price 29668. So this is step one. Now, of course, you know, why didn't he buy that 347 million when it was trading at $16,000 or $18,000 or $20,000? Everybody was panicking back then, just trying to hold the breath. Holding the breath for Terra Luna, for FTX, for Binance, all kinds of bad news keep coming out, right? Okay. So this is good. So I covered the step one and then, you know, I put a gray horizontal line to tell you I'm thinking of the next idea already. And the next idea is this. This one is really, really interesting. Interesting. Because on 15 June, this is the date. So 15 of June, BlackRock officially filed a Bitcoin spot ETF. I mean, through 2017, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, they've never done that. This is the first virgin file. And why is this so important? Because it triggered what we call a great accumulation race around Bitcoin, all right? So let me give you the statistics, which is very, very scary. Number one, of all the filings, an application made by BlackRock, they have only failed one time. Their win ratio is 575 versus losing one application. No one got this kind of record. This is the highest ever. So it's like de facto, they are the godfather, Larry Fink, right? And because, you know, in a way, they are like the shadow backer of the US government and they are very close to the to the leadership so this is the one that kind of uh, really crazy because this 575 winning record is fighting head on against 33 versus 0 so far no applications have been approved 33 rejected so look at this too <laughs> it's like total heaven and earth right so why now? Why now and why is on 15th of June? Okay, so that was my intrigue to get me motivated to write this article. I say, why now? Why not last year? Why not in the middle of F FTX or in the middle of Terra Luna? Why now? So... From here, we go now, and you can see my gray line appear already. Ding, ding. Right, my gray line appear again. Now I'm thinking on the next idea already. Because I'm thinking about 5th of November, which is the next presidential election date, which is counting down one year. 
And what is really, really significant is this. Okay? The last election, the Democratic Party was funded by FTX. I think what is published is $40 million. I think beyond $40 million, I think it funded more than $40 million. 